Hello, hello everyone. Welcome to Voice of Russia for you. Thanks for clicking. And today I'd like to continue my previous video that unfortunately was cut short uh, because I had run out of my free memory space on my memory card. Uh, fortunately, it happened right when I was about to say my goodbye words. So I think it's not a problem. Well, so today I'd like to sum up my previous video and give you some details I forget I forgot to give you uh, during my previous uh, video so the first of all I'd like to mention that you know in English we call the fir tree that we bring to our houses a Christmas tree so actually in Russia we don't call it Christmas tree we call it the New Year tree because as I have already told you we don't uh, celebrate Christmas of course, uh, you know, in some point we, celeb we do celebrate Christmas, but it's not that popular so that everybody uh, would set up a, a holiday Christmas table. No, normally a vast majority of Russians celebrate New Year. So, we decorate the Christmas tree and those family who have children uh, put uh, the gifts for their children under the Christmas tree so the next day their children could wake up and pick up their presents from uh, under the Christmas tree from <laughs> the New Year tree I'm sorry uh, so we don't put the uh, gifts into the stockings we don't use it we don't have this tradition so we just put them under the Christmas tree. Okay, I'll be calling it Christmas tree. It's okay, since it's uh, it's an English word and I'm speaking English right now. So I'll be calling it Christmas tree. And also, uh, we sometimes put the small figures of, uh, you call it San Santa Claus in English, and we call it, in Russian it goes like, Diet Maros, uh, that can be literally translated as Old Man Frost. It's uh, he's similar to Santa Claus. Uh, I think the only difference is that his coat is a little bit longer. His coat is uh, about uh, floor length, so it's uh, pretty long. And this uh, Old Man Frost has a companion. It's a small girl whose name is Snigurichka in, Ru in, in Russian. That stands for, it can be roughly translated as a snowy girl. And she meant to be his grand granddaughter. So this uh, Christmas um, old man Frost walks around with his granddaughter, snowy girl. Uh, so we uh, quite often we put these two figures under the Christmas tree. And uh, what else? So how we celebrate? Uh, ah, and of course, uh, I said that traditionally people get around their tables in their apartments, but nowadays a lot of people go out go to the restaurants, some people buy some tours and fly away to other countries. You know, over time a lot has changed immensely and you know, people started to adopt uh, Western traditions. So probably somebody already put uh, gifts into the stockings, maybe. I, I'm not sure, but it's, but it's possible. So everything is changing, interchanging with uh, other cultures so I think uh, a lot of people celebrate uh, the New Year holidays differently and what about uh, greetings I already said I have already said that people normally shake hands I mean men shake hands women either say just say hello or sometimes give a small peck on the cheek so it's again differently and again I'd like to mention that everything 
I have said is just general rules. As I have already told you, everything is changing and people adopt a lot from the West. You know, I think all the world countries are Amer Americanized quite a lot and Russia isn't an exception. So I think that's it for today. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. And if you have other questions, feel free asking me. And see you next time. Bye.